Dr. Jeremy Weiss here. I'm founder of InspiredInsider.com where I talk with inspirational entrepreneurs and leaders like the founders of P90X, Baby Einstein, Atari, many more, how they overcome big challenges in life and business. This is part of the Skubana e-commerce mastery series where top sellers and experts teach you what really works to boost your e-commerce business. Skubana is a software platform to manage your entire e-commerce operation. Gary's going to talk about some software too today. Today we have Gary Nealon. He's founder of RTA Cabinet Store and he's built an eight-figure e-commerce business. He's the owner of Rocks Group, which is a collection of e-commerce sites in the home improvement niche of all things, which includes one of the largest online distributors and importers of kitchen cabinets in the U.S. They've been featured on over 80 shows, HDTV, A&E, and several others. He's been featured on the Inc. 500, 5000, as well as Philly's 100 fastest growing companies. If that wasn't enough, Gary, you also run winetrailadventures.com and Nealon Solutions Marketing Company. Gary, thanks for joining me. Oh, thanks for having me. Since it's the Scubana e-commerce mastery series, I always ask, what's been the, the lowest e-commerce moment and what's been the proudest? e-commerce moment well if i had to say lowest it would probably be the previous business and filing bankruptcy uh because that was sort of an e-commerce business that we had um that's a tough pill to swallow Um, what was tough about it like for people who haven't gone through it or people who have what was tough for you for me it was more letting the people down that i got to invest in it uh it wasn't really i wasn't too concerned about me for whatever reason i've never been at risk adverse so uh, keep it in this business. I'll take some risks that probably most people probably wouldn't take. Yeah. Um, but I know it's me that I'm impacting, and then at that time it was other people. So I think that was probably the hardest part of it. Like the fact that I went through that process of finding investors, they trusted me enough to invest in the product. Yeah. And then I didn't, didn't have either the skill set or the circumstances around it, just didn't work out to actually get their money back. So um, I think that was probably the toughest part of that was just dealing with the concept that I cost somebody else something instead of just myself. Yeah, yeah. Um, in terms of highs for us, yeah. um, obviously, my one that we're probably, I'm probably the most proud of is getting on the Inc. 500 um, the last four years, um, fully 100 the last three years. So kind of getting that uh, recognition um, that I know it's not just me, it's everybody in the, in the business, all the employees and everything, but um, being able to be recognized is something that, you know, especially coming from somebody that just filed bankruptcy 10 years ago and building up to yeah. a figure so I think that's probably what we're that's huge. Yeah. That's awesome. So what should we leave people with, Gary? We talked a lot about a lot of different things in e-commerce. What, yeah. what lesson should we end with? The lesson to end with is, uh, I think, kind of what we started with. is like Get to know who your real customer is. Like yeah. You can figure that. If you're really in e-commerce and you, you want to build a business instead of just sell products, the easiest way to turn it into a business is to make sure you know who your customers are and talk directly to them. Um, don't just think that you have to advertise to everybody. Uh, focus in on the ones that are your true customer base and your conversions and your sales are going to go through the roof. Yeah, yeah. Gary, I appreciate this. My last question is, can you still dunk a basketball? The fun fact is, Gary played college basketball. That's a good question. Uh, I haven't tried in probably two years. <laughs> um, I'd like to think I could, but I'm not going to make any promises. <laughs> I would bet on you. But I'm thank you. Get old, what, What's that? So I'm getting old. I don't know that I can anymore. You're six seven. I think you can do it. <laughs> Thank you, Gary. I really appreciate it. This has been awesome. Awesome. Thanks for having me.